Call the hive! Call the hive! Call the hive! Baby, finally it's here! Yeah! Let's get it! <laughs> Welcome back to the channel guys, I am E and I create MTG content and budget streaming content. So, it's finally here, call the hive. As always, what I do is I open up a box, let's see if we can recruit the money. We can only use the rares and mythics inside uh, this box, we're not going to count the uncommons and commons, and we're only going to count uh, items that can be sold for a dollar and above. Alright, let's start. Boom, opening the set. Shh. All right, quick disclaimer, I haven't familiarized myself with the set, so I don't know which cards are good. I will have to check this one later, posts. So, let's get cracking. All right, all right, snow-covered island, infernal pet, and raven's warning. Okay, come on, come on, let's do the same. Next. Berserker, Snow Covered, Dragon uh, Necromancer. Come on, come on. Okay, that's human. Snow Covered. Oh, Vortex! <laughs> I didn't know much, but I know that this is a good card. Vortex is, I believe, one of the expensive cards, so we got one. No problem. More Berserker. The Bloody Massacre. Cool. We got a Warren Clex, boys. Warren Clex in the house. Berserker. And those Arnie, Broken Bow. Okay, this is the Homan Warrior. Snow Covered Swamp. Cosmos Charger. Ooh. Spirit. Forest and. Ralph, God of Fury is our second mythic. Nicely done. Treasure. Snow covered. Old growth troll. Look at that troll. It's that one. Comma coil. A foil bite stuff pathway. Nice. EA foil. Boom. This this box is hot. Walking the trolls. Nicely done. This box is hot, boys. Ladies and gents. Boys and girls. Shards. And we have another pathway. Hinge gate pathway. Blue white. Nicely done. Box is hot. Okay, we have these. Uh, King Narfi's Betrayal. Uh, weathered Runestone is actually good for an uncommon. Kate Artifact for an uncommon. Fortel. It's kind of cool. Boom! This is, I believe, our third mythic. All Rand, God of Cosmos. Nice. This is the... Come on. Come on. Magda, Brazen Outlaw. We're not even... A couple of packs. We're just a couple of packs in. Hopefully that's good. Elvish War Master. Okay. Kind of cool. Boom. And snow covered. We have a Fear Just Retribution. Nice. Boom. I think this is our fourth mythic Alrun's Epiphany. Right, right, right. Nice. Welcome to Arena. Woodland and Reflection of Litjara. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. We have Berserker, Snow Covered, and Realm Walker, the BOB. Buy a box promo for this set. Realm Walker Foil. Alright. Welcome to Arena. Snow Covered. Great Hall of Starnhelm. And we have In Search of Greatness. Heard this is a good stipulation card or a um investment card maybe it's good maybe it's not but it's something very interesting on the set just looking for that tibalt trickery right we have this swamp and ooh, a foil rally the ranks our second mythic uh, our second rare foil and 
The World Tree. Nice one. <laughs> Love it. Okay. This box is hot. I don't know how much it is, but looks like it's pretty up there. Have this. Okay. Runeforge Champion. Alright. One, two, and Battle of the Frost Fire. Okay. Okay. Boom. Boom. And Gold Span Dragon. I believe this is our fifth mythic. I'm not sure. Oh my god. Uh, my count might be wrong, but uh, the average of a box is four mythics, I believe. If this is the fifth mythic, then we are super lucky. This uh, mythic rare is super good. Extremely good so far. We have another foil rare. This is the Raven's Warning foil. And Tegrid, God of Fright. Nice. We're almost finished. I believe this is like third to the last pile. We have a bird, a raven right here. Ice Tunnel. Pyre of Heroes. It's not that bad. Human. Another Blight Step Pathway. EA foil. I it's not foil. Just EA. Look at that artwork. Super great. Goodness. Glorious Protector. We'd be lucky if we get another mythic. I hope so. We are second to the last pile. And Calamity Bearer. Not bad. Torbeer's uh, distant cousin, I guess. <laughs> Arena and Snow Covered Plains. And we have Iceberg Icebreaker Kraken. Mm -hmm. Spirit of Isengard. And there you go. Move it there. Move it here. We have this one and this one we have Harold Harold unites the elves mmm so somehow they have been ununited human warrior sulfur mines and struggle and we have Jorn god of winter nice nice so many good cards so many potentially good cards I myself is an EDH player, so quite excited with that. Giant Wizard, Snow Covered Plains, and Faceless Haven. This is one of the Manland cards on the set, which is, I heard, is great. Alright, we're back. Boom. Treasure. Alpine Meadows, and our rare is. Cosmos Elixir. We are down to our last pile. Three more. Dwarven Berserker. Snow Covered. Reckless Crew. We got the Reckless Crew. Elf Warrior. We have Graven Lore. Mm. And last but not the least. Snow Covered Swamp and Call Vori, God of Kinship. Right! That is everything on the set. Time to find out if we were able to recoup our cost. Time to wave the magic hand. Alright, uh, there you have it. Our first Kaldeheim box opening. We got this box for $90, 90 US dollars, and we got from TCG Mid. A total 143 US dollars. Our notable rares are stated right here. So overall, if the market still prevails and the price still persists, which they rarely do, we have gained $50 upon a review. All right, that's it guys. There are a tons of exploring that needs to be done on Kaldeheim. There are good cards, potential good cards inside the set, both within standard and outside standard. So what are you waiting for? Grab a quick Kaldeheim in your local game store. If you enjoyed this video, check out some of my box openings here. As always, stay safe.